My name is Rosie Kay and I'm a choreographer and performer and artistic director of my own dance company. Um, what keeps me going is really the passion for what I do. Like I really love dance, I love to read about it, I love to do it, I love to watch it, I love to help people uh, learn about it in lots of different ways, I love to teach it. Um, I think also what keeps me going is kind of constantly staying curious, staying kind of wanting to find out more. For example, um, I'm about to go to India, I hope, to do some research, like keeping ideas really fresh and keep constantly looking for new, new things. Um, I think what's important with running your own company is sorting out the support systems. I mean, really from day one, uh, before we were even a limited company, I got my board of advisors together. So it's grown from about three board members to now six. And you have to kind of find the right people that are going to have the right skills that you like and that are also going to commit their time to you. That's really important. As I've gone on, I've kind of developed certain different other support systems. I get a lot of advice and help from Dance Exchange, from other dance agencies. But also I have a wonderful business mentor. And recently, um, I've worked a little bit with like a life business coach because I realized that the person running the business is me and I, I need help, actually. Um, not just the business, but me personally as well. Um, I think one of the important things to think about when you're starting and, 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 and kind of creating your own business and your own enterprise is it's okay to fail. It doesn't feel okay at all, but actually you learn so much by failing. Sometimes that's the only way you're going to really find your success. And when you make your success, you're going to know that you own it. You're not going to have a sense like, where did this come from? You're going to really understand why you're successful and how you did it. So don't be afraid of the failures, but kind of learn to deal with sort of coping strategies so that the failures don't drag you under, underground. That's where the support systems really come in. So I think for me, like dance, dance for me really has the ability to change the way we think, change the way we feel, change the way we see the world. And I kind of feel that dance has the power to transform people's lives, uh, both by watching dance, but also by participating and by experiencing power of sort of expression uh, that dance can bring you. So that's my advice.